If I hosted a talk show, I'd say Robert Downey Jr. Uh, love him in the Avengers movies and in Sherlock Holmes. I think he's a, he's a cool actor and a cool guy, so it'll be interesting to talk to him. Coach Jack Daniels, he was my college coach before I came to West Point, and he was the smartest, most inspirational person I've ever met. Zach Galifianakis, and I would call it Between Two Plants, and I would interview him instead of the other way around. Ellen DeGeneres. Thierry Henry, just because he's one of my idols, great guy, funny. Probably David Hill. Um, probably Oprah Winfrey, because she's awesome. Jennifer Aniston, by far, straight down, hands down. Honestly, it would be like someone who owns koalas, so I can hold one, because I've never done it, and it's just a life goal. Jamie Foxx. So Jamie Foxx is probably like a universal just entertainer overall. He's, um, he's, a, he's quite a character, you know, and on the other side, he sings a lot, so I mean, he, he probably bring a little spice to the, to the show. Oh, LeBron James, because he's the best athlete in the country right now. Ryan Gallagher, because uh, he's going to be famous by then, I'm sure. Channing Tatum. Forrest Gump, <laughs> because he's awesome. Joe Lugosh and Joseph Prevall as a team. George W. Bush, because he's the man. <laughs> Emma Stone, diehard fan. Jimmy Fallon, because he's incredible. Pamela Wishart, just because she's Pam. I'd probably, I'd probably say Coach Munkin because I think a lot of people ask a lot of questions what he's like and not everyone knows so you know if, if we got him out there on a talk show I think everyone would get a real taste of him. Derek Jeter because he's the captain of everything. Probably Jack Barnett because he's huge and a great athlete. Celine Dion so she can sing. <laughs> Jeff Mominon because he's hilarious. Uh, Jeff K. Uh, Jimmy Fallon. Brooke Hepfer obviously. Brooke you want to come join? 